Today, I'm gonna to show you guys how to automatically archive emails older than 24 hours in Gmail. But first, why would we wanna do that? The most successful people in the world respond instantly. When you email the billionaire CEO, it's like a 30 second response. And when you email his vice president, it's, you know, it can be a week or something. That is just so true. I really try and force myself to respond fast. I, I wrote this little script for, for Gmail that, um, it archives my email every 24 hours. So I like have to respond or it just disappears. And I feel like it's a really good nudge of like, just send send the simpler text messages like response. So if you like this idea, stick around and I'm gonna show you how to set this up. So the first thing we're gonna do is open up Google Apps Script. We'll select new project. Then we'll go ahead and write our script. We'll call it auto archive emails. It's gonna be pretty simple. We're gonna use the Gmail app to search for all emails older than 24 hours. We'll move each thread older than 24 hours to the archive. We'll save our project and give it a name. Let's open up Gmail to see what our inbox looks like. As you can see, I have several emails older than 24 hours still in my inbox. Let's go back to our script and click run to see if it works. You have to allow the script to access your Gmail account. Since this is a custom script, Google hasn't verified it, but we know what we're doing. Click advance so we can authorize the script. We now see the execution of our script is started. All emails older than 24 hours are automatically archived. Pretty cool, huh? Now I have a lot of emails in Gmail, so it's going to take a long time to iterate over every email older than 24 hours. A few moments later. The script has now completed. Since I plan to archive emails older than 24 hours every day, I really don't need to look through my entire catalog of emails when I run this script. We can make the script more efficient by only looking at the emails older than one day and newer than two days. Press Command S to save, and now you can see the script takes a lot less time to run. So up until this point, we've been running the script manually, but come on, we're engineers. We love automation. We'll create a trigger to automatically run this script on our behalf. We'll configure our trigger to run every day at midnight. Once you're ready, click save, and we should be good to go. So I hope you found this video helpful. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Until then, see you next time.